So this is gonna be like the part two of the moving vlog. I'm sorry about my voice. My room is very stuffy. I can like barely breathe. It is the morning of moving day. And um, I'm currently just um, putting together a box so I can get all of the clothes out of my closet in there. I'm gonna do the bag thing where you just put all your clothes that are hung up inside of a trash bag. <clears throat> just wrap it around this. You don't have to worry about like hanging everything up again. I might even put some t-shirts on hangers that are already in my closet. That way I can probably just throw the trash bags in a box so I don't have to worry about them like getting ripped open, you know, and stuff and getting dirty. But, you know, it just makes it a little easier to move it and not have to like unfold everything again or hang everything up again. And then I have the box right here. I'm not sure why it's so close my toes i have a box right here uh it's my closet so here's my little dresser it is literally so small um i'm thinking we're just going to take the drawers out and like set them somewhere when we move the dresser to um why is she listening to me take the drawers out when we move the dresser and then when we get the dresser in the u-haul we're gonna put the drawers back in there that way just make it a little easier and maybe i'll just like put tape around the edges so they don't open or i'll just put stuff against to make sure it doesn't open um literally it's so like if you had never walked in my room you probably wouldn't even um, unless the if these boxes weren't here you probably would never know that i was moving like this area used to be completely covered in um sheets and blankets like if I were to touch up there, everything would fall. So that's why I would never get anything from up there. But like I went through everything that was up there and picked out the things that I really wanted to keep. <clears throat> so now I have more than one set of sheets to use. Um, but yeah, I have two boxes right now. <clears throat> if you saw that. Um, one, like I said, is going to be for the clothes. And the other one is going to be for the ferret stuff. So anything... Um, obviously, I do not plan on bringing them when I um first go over there i want to get everything set up first and then i don't plan on leaving them here overnight because like you know i don't want to leave them without their cage and make them being using pee pads for the next 24 hours because i work the follow i work tomorrow and i would not have time to come back take them to my place and then come back this area to work because i have my job has not transferred over yet to the location i'm gonna be living in but why am i dying but yeah so i have their little carrier up there that i'm going to leave here with them i'm going to wash all of their blankets and just leave one blanket uh one of the smaller blankets to put inside of the carrier along with a little toy for them um i have food and water out for them right now i'm recording on my phone if i didn't already mention that um somebody was just calling me it was a scam call <coughs> but like i said i already have food and water out for them so um Hopefully, they eat that by the time I come to get them later today. And move-in time is until 4 o'clock. I think I mentioned that in the other video. So, it might be a little late when I come. It's obviously going to be dark because of the time change again. <clears throat> but, I still need a shower. So, once I get all of my clothes in this box, not including the clothes that are still in the wash because I'm finishing washing clothes. Once I get all the clothes what is in the box, I'm going to take a quick shower. Um, Sydney's going to come back and help me finish packing everything up. We have to, like I said, take everything out of the ferret cage, um, put it in the washer, and then I'm going to take, I'm going to spray the crap out of this cage because it really needs to be cleaned. <clears throat> and I have to lay it down in my car and it, it it should fit there really shouldn't be a problem with it fitting i'd be surprised if there were and if it doesn't fit i'll just have to make room in the u-haul for it and then just worry about putting like the boxes of kitchen appliances in my car um <clears throat> so here's coco messing around on my bed do you like those bags <laughs> he's so funny but 
yes and i also it's like obviously it's take all the sheets off my bed those are getting washed too and i have this box right here is like full of sheets and then i think i'm just gonna have to like rearrange it so everything else will fit actually i don't know if the blankets will fit and i also have four pillows so i might need to get another box of that too but it's okay because there's more boxes um if i run out of the ones that are already out i have another like there's more boxes in the garage so we're going to time lapse now because i want to listen to music and like i said i gotta take a shower so we're gonna get this done quickly <laughs> as you can see um i am currently taking the sheets off of my bed so i can wash those because the last load of my laundry is being finished up in the washer um i just took some of the other clothes that were in the dryer out and folded them and put them in the box um so this is what we have left in the closet after the first bag which is at the in the box it was really difficult i feel like i put way too much in there so Hopefully, the rest of this fits in the last bag. Uh, well, this doesn't really matter. Hopefully, just this fits in the last bag. And then I'll probably just get, like, um, store bags, you know, like, shopping bags to put, like, my shoes in. Because I don't want to have to worry about them getting, like, any clothes dirty or gross, you know. And we're going to do another quick time lapse. Um, I'm just going to take all the stuff off of there. And I'll take y'all to the... Um, <laughs> I'm just gonna take everything off my bed, like I said, and take you guys to the laundry room with me. Um, it's probably gonna take me two loads to finish my clothes, which sucks because I want to like have this stuff done. Actually, I need to take these curtains down. I keep forgetting. I mean, they've been up for a while, and like you know, stuff gets dusty over time. So I don't want to just like throw them into the new apartment. I want to actually wash them first, and I also have two more because it came in a set of two so i have two up and then there's two outside that i um i need to put in the wash as well so i don't know how quickly you're gonna be able to see that but um i actually got this i don't know if my grandma gave me this whole mattress or just this thing which i didn't even know was here by the way i just knew that my bed was a lot more comfortable than it was Cause like this stuff, I used to have a different dresser. I never even knew I had a TV chest before. And I also had a different desk. Um, so it like all matches each other. And then like, you know, the headboard goes with it and everything. But I didn't know this was under here. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure you don't wash this. I think, oh wait, it's a zipper. I guess you could wash this cover, but honestly, I don't see like any stains on it or anything. So I think it's fine. Um, just later if it happens to be stains on wash because i guess it just goes under the mattress topper it's like a little memory foam thing so that oh <laughs> i guess that explains why my bed has been so much more comfortable um but yeah i shoved everything inside of my basket and i think the last load of clothes should be done by now in the wash at least and then yeah, it's definitely going to take me two loads for the sheets. So hopefully um, that will go by quickly. And then, oh, I also, like, I keep forgetting. I have to take the curtains down. Okay, so, you know, I work at Starbucks. So here's my coffee. Um, I do an ice caramel macchiato with oat milk. And I just mix the shots in there and all the extra can drizzle um, some to the bottom. And then I also made cold foam out of the milk, but, like the oat milk, but and I'm pretty sure it's just turned back into milk. And if anything, I could just add some more to there. That way it has a little more milk because I left some room. Um, and then I also brought, oh no, I'm not trying to drop that. I also brought food. Um, and then I think that's what I'm just going to be eating 
So like, I put all of the blankets in here so far. Um, next is the sheets and the comforter. Oh, yeah, it's covered in the sheets and comforter. Other clothes are on the dryer. If I had like one of those little frother things, I would do it. But I was thinking that since I put so much, it'd probably stay. But no. I'm just add some. There's my drink. And then I have go check out a hummus box. And everything bagel with avocado spread. I'm back. Um, so Sydney's here now. Um, I ate a little bit of like my breakfast, but I wanted to, that's the washer because I put too many blankets in there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my Starbeast Christmas apron. <laughs> um, we're just folding up the clothes I took out of the dryer. This is the last load of clothes. Um, so we can put them in the box and then we also have like that stuff there and then the stuff in the closet. So we're gonna get that done. Hopefully the washer would have drained the blankets by then because they're like sopping wet because I need to do one more load of sheets and then the ferret stuff. So I need to go by quickly. In front of me. <laughs> I'll try. I don't know, what do you think would be better? I think you should go behind me. Okay. And I'll like, and then just follow me. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Ready? Yeah, make sure you take the road. Okay, just drive safe. Which way do you want me to go? That way or this way? This way. Okay. But I don't want to go, I don't want to go over more speed bumps. <laughs> okay, <close me. laughs> Okay, so we're in the U-Haul now. <laughs> this thing is huge, bro. It's a 15-footer. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm literally so scared. <clears throat> I'm going to turn on air because literally I'm like sweating. Okay, the air is on. We're about to start driving this mofo. I'm gonna follow her just like she said. And hoping I do not die because, again, there's no rear view mirror in this thing. So, I've never driven anything this big. I told her to pull up over there because this car is going. Sheesh. Okay. Um. We don't know how to open that. Oh, you got it? Never mind. We do know how to open it. Oh, it's big. It's big. You got it, dude. It um, oh. Well, I guess it's a good thing it didn't open. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Sheesh. You know what you're doing. I don't. <laughs> oh. This shit's heavy. You're doing it, though. Muscles. Look, it says Arizona. <laughs> Will it stop when it gets to the end? I think so. <laughs> the whole thing falls out. <laughs> it's it's so long. Oh, okay, okay. Why does it sound like that? Okay. Anyways. <laughs> Runway! <laughs> Actually, no, I'm still sweaty. Um, Sydney's currently picking up my brother from school because we're literally dying doing this ourselves. We already got all of the um, couch in the truck. So that part is fine. It's just the fact that stuff is still washing and that not everything is completely packed up. Um, I mean, most of the loose stuff we'll just have to put inside of boxes or in the cars that we're taking. Um, I'm trying, I was trying to pack up one of the boxes and then I ran out of tape. So like, this is like duct tape. So, but Sydney says she has more in her car. So I'm probably just gonna wait for her to come and just like put together all the other stuff I need to put in the box. Put my little guys in here. I didn't want them running out the door. The door has been open. And I put their little toys in there and a little blankie. 
they want out and I feel really bad. Obviously, I'm not gonna keep them in, a long, in there for a long period of time. I have like the fan going, cause it is hot. Well, I'm hot because, you know, I'm going back and forth and moving stuff. So. Um, but the, like, the breeze is nice, so it's not too bad. And um, they're only gonna be in there until we leave. Um, so hopefully Sydney's mom gets here soon. And um, yeah, hopefully Sydney's mom gets here soon and hopefully my, her and Sydney and my brother get here soon because our plan was to leave at three and it's 2.48. So obviously that's not happening. Um, so I'm hoping that once they get here, we'll be able to move a lot faster and get everything out of here and hopefully leave by at least 3.15, 3.30 the latest because I'm not trying to be late because the, um, the people who work at the apartment complex, they leave at like five, so. I honestly don't remember the last time I recorded, but we're in the apartment. Um, it was really stressful getting here. Also, the fact that um, when we got in here, I was waiting to grab like the last couple papers I needed and the keys. I almost peed myself. So I ran in there immediately and went to the bathroom and um, the freaking toilet didn't flush. So you had to fix it, but it's all good now. And I will give you guys a little show of what we already put in here. So that's the front door. You can see my Christmas trees out there. We have bunch of stuff over here and this is the carpet uh, I'm not gonna have light until I bring the lamp back from the house um, this has to be set up we have my bed it's no longer on the stand just because it's easier this way I guess and I'm not gonna worry about the ferrets pooping there I'm gonna close these cuz I don't people looking in here um, but yeah my TV chest is there. We're going to move it over more. We're just waiting till we put the um, stuff in there because I have to plug it up still. And there's like a hole in the back. Did I just ask us if we needed help? And Lauren said no. <gasps> no, go knock on the door. Hi, I am the cleaner. I am cleaning her bathroom and putting her shower curtains up. Oh, put that in there. Yeah, her toilet is in the middle being clean. Her shower's pretty clean, low key, but we're probably gonna clean it still. But we have the shower curtains. This one. Hopefully, it's the same now. Hello? Update. I know you guys can barely see me, but um, we finally got the big piece of the couch and we took it through like the little balcony and put it over, which is a hassle. Um, I'm currently getting bit by bugs and it really sucks. There's like three stray cats on what? Oh, <laughs> there's three stray. Well, actually, can you get it off? It might have fleas. Yeah, okay. There's three stray cats who keep walking in and out of my apartment. And I was walking back from away from the balcony because I didn't climb over it and only Lauren did. And I was walking back to the front door and the cat the, the cats were walking out. And <laughs> I scared the crap out one of the cats. It like started like sliding across the floor and then it ran out. Oh, 
when the cats are about to come. Sydney, turn around. I see it. <laughs> Hi, kitty. This is so funny. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I know you guys are barely gonna be able to see me, and I probably shouldn't really be doing this while I'm driving, but it's fine. I'm not gonna really look at the camera. Um, we just um, brought the U-Haul back to my mom's place, and the reason we brought it back here instead of just taking it or filling the gas up and then taking it back to the U-Haul place is because um, the last piece of the couch that like sticks out didn't fit in the apartment. Like there would not have been any winning walking room if we kept it there. So we brought that back. We also um, took my bed off of like the thing. We just put the box spring on the floor. That way my ferrets don't like try to poop under the bed anymore or anything. Um, I don't have to worry about like trying to find, find them hiding under the bed, which is fine because they have plenty of other spots. Um, I'm sure they're probably gonna get inside of the couch. Uh, which I'm going to try to prevent them from doing that because I don't really like that. And then um, they also have like their toys and stuff. So that's fine. But Sydney's so driving my car right now in front of me. And we are taking this to the gas station because, you know, you have to fill the gas back up. Oh, what the? Okay, jerk. You have to fill the gas back up to where it was when you got it. Um... And then we're gonna stop at, or we're gonna drop this off and stop at the uh, grocery store and get a couple more drinks. We're uh, going to go grocery shopping tonight, but neither of us have the energy to. Um, we're just gonna get drinks. We have pizza there that we're gonna finish that her mom ordered. And then we also have like ramen noodles and like popcorn. We're gonna finish unpacking everything. And I know we're both gonna sleep super good. I'm supposed to be working tomorrow, but I think my manager is gonna help me find somebody to cover my shift, which I am so thankful for because I really, I am not gonna have the energy to work tomorrow at all, like whatsoever. Even if I were to go to bed on time, I would not have the energy to do it. <laughs> and it would really help because I have, today's Monday, tomorrow's Tuesday, obviously. I have Wednesday off anyways. And if somebody were to offer me a shift, I can get my hours back from that. Or I can just have more relaxing time. And just, you know, sinking into the feel of the apartment. Um, I'm going to put this down because I'm going on the main road. And I don't want to get pulled over. But. Um, yes, yeah, so that's what we're doing. I have not been able to record a lot. Just because we've been busy moving everything. And it's been very difficult and literally everybody was so cranky because we hadn't eaten in like hours so that's just another reason why i don't have a lot of footage but i'm definitely now that it's just sydney and i and it's not several people i'll definitely be able to uh record more and talk to the camera more and yeah so i will get back to you guys when i'm not in this loud u-haul truck we finally have gotten the U-Haul back. Um, it's just gonna clock. It's yes, dude, it is. Fucking, we're both tired. Is gonna fucking turn off? I really hope so. Okay. Should we wait and make sure? Why is it beeping? Just cut, I think, I don't know. Maybe I should redo the driver door. <laughs> I really hope it turns off because I want to go back to my place and relax. <laughs> it's still on. Okay, we're back at the apartment. Um, as you can see, it is very, very. Sydney, how messy is it in here? Huh? How messy is it in here? It's not that bad. Are you sure? Are you sure? It could be worse. It could be worse. But then there's like, we have like just enough walk room. Yeah. Here's my little guys. I mean, like, it's movable, you know? Yeah. I'm about to feed them after I do this. I cut my finger on this board up here. Um, it really hurt. But um, I got these little, I showed them early. I'm pretty sure I showed these earlier. I mean, like, they're like motion censored. 
why can't I speak words? Under the thing where the sink is. Um, that way I don't have to like you turn on a bunch of lights. You know, like you just like want some motion lights every once in a while. Your what? Box uh, good. Yeah. Um, see it's already on. But I just put the double or the triple A batteries in there. Where are you gonna put it? Um I don't know. Where do you think? Behind the toilet. Behind the toilet. <laughs> Thinks I should put it behind the toilet. The bathroom is kind of small, but it's whatever. I don't want it to be in a gross spot. I don't know. But I will let you guys know. And like I said, I'm actually going to start recording more as long as my phone stays charged. Okay. Um, so right now we're putting you know, put dishes in the dishwasher. Because obviously I'm not going to eat on stuff that I just bought from the store. Unless I clean it first. So I got my stack for the small plates. Um, I'm not, if this is not all going to fit, but I'm going to see what I can. Actually, I'm probably just going to do the small ones first, to be honest. Okay, um, so I just started the first actual load of dishes. When we first got here, we just ran it um, with like white vinegar in there just to like clean it out itself. Um, we are currently working on the kitchen, so we're just gonna get that done first and I guess just work our way through. Um, I got a bandit on me because, you know, I cut my finger. But, this is what we're- What? Snacks. Granola True. Bars and shit. Or you can put it in your fridge and put drinks in it. I think with the containers I already have, it's going to be full. I'm being honest, dude. Yeah, but so this is what we're working with right now. It's always zoomed in when I first start recording. This is the front door. I don't know if the lamp is going to say that. The trash can is actually going to go here. We just had it out of the way for right now. We're just using it because obviously we're putting everything away. Um, I think I already mentioned it earlier. But the... Part of the couch that goes like this and then out here, <laughs> it didn't fit. So we just are literally throwing that away. We took it back to my mom's house. Um, got boxes here. This TV was really heavy. We're gonna have to wait until we have other people here again to try to mount it up. And I hope it'll work. I, <laughs> the TV is Sydney, look. The TV's like the size of the freaking wall. I just realized the freaking thermostat is there. Um, but he said something about the smart thermo thermostat. Which is like the circle one, right? Mm -hmm. So that would be... I mean, you can just always like just stick your hand back there, but you won't be able to see it. But you can't... I don't think you can move it. We'll figure it out. I mean, the couch has to be there, and that's the only other... Alright, so we have... Sydney's helping me set up. We got the coffee machine. Stuff that needs to be washed up. We have the microwave she got. And the toaster, so I can just take it down um, whenever I need it. Uh, I just have the butter and these in here right now. Nothing in these cabinets. Got the cutting boards. Um, I think I have, yeah, you know, I have one more cutting board that can go in here. Um, measuring cups, and measuring spoons, and clips for the chip bags whenever I get those. And then um, once the dishwasher is done, we're gonna put all the silverware in here. So out soon I got the bigger utensils the um tray that came for the cooking utensils did not fit in the drawer so Sydney decided or yeah we can put like snacks in there <laughs> that would be good um okay so we got all this out um taking all the stuff out of the dryer or what am I saying the dishwasher right now and Sydney's putting it all away <laughs> um so we have going on i will come back to show you guys it later once it is finished but now i'm gonna get started on the bathroom that way i can start working my way around the room um i think i said it earlier i'm not unpacking that yet because this needs to be um this first okay so this one needs to be fixed because it's hanging off the wall and then when he walked me through he said they have to remount this one so tomorrow when we wake up when we wake up and like get ready to leave i'm gonna actually stop in the office um, just to ask him when, 
I would honestly prefer tomorrow because I don't want to keep like keep the stuff inside that box obviously I don't think anyone would want to um but yeah I'm going to start off with putting everything into the shower I got it needs to go in there I'm actually going to grab a wipe to wipe something down because there's like stuff that I brought from the house is still dirty for some reason so, or well, I haven't done it yet but let's see I don't know where to put the phone in that. We'll just, you know, show you that it's not gonna work. So it's gonna have to be freaking, yeah. Oh, it's literally on the off one. Okay. So this is like, I can't even tell what that is that's on this for some reason, but it looks gross, so I'll wipe it down first. Okay. It looks nice now. Actually, there's still stuff on it. <laughs> um, I lied. I said I was going to do the shower first, but I really want to move this under the sink and then move stuff that should be in the shower in the shower. Because I also have this to hang up. So I can start filling it up once I figure out everything that's like bathroom stuff. Um, I don't know where the other drawer is. To be honest, I think it's in one of my other boxes. So I guess that's going to take a hot minute. But this is the one that was under the sink. I had my mom get Yes, okay, both of them are gonna fit, but I need to take this other stuff out. This will probably just. Yes! Oh, it's perfect. It's literally so perfect. Okay, so. um, This is gonna go back in the shower. Oh no. It's my razor, but like the putty stuff. I don't know if it's gonna stick again. I might have to order a new thing. Oh, it's right here. I did not want all these cheer bows on the bottom anyways. I got my blow dryer, which I hope will fit. And this is the hanger for, yeah, I don't think it's gonna fit. What? Yeah. So this stuff I just put on top of, oh yeah, it's definitely not gonna fit. Wow, I don't know what to do. Cause this was sitting on top of the drawers or the drawer at first. Frick. Well, I think there might be room in between. I just, I literally don't know. Hold on. I just did all that for no reason. I, I, I see the other drawer. It's literally on the bed. Which I'm gonna grab now because I really need to figure out how all this is gonna fit in there. And I wish, I feel like if the move in time was a lot earlier in the day, I wouldn't have slept longer. Like, I think I would have gotten up right away and wouldn't have stayed up late. And we would definitely have a lot more done, and I would have already gotten groceries. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, that's where it is. And chopsticks. We're about to be using those. Okay. Doors. Um, this is what I was using at the other place. This was just um holding other stuff until I moved. Um I have to move them this way slightly just so they open fine. Otherwise they get stuck. That's not a big deal. Um the only thing is um, like I said, this, these are the baskets I was using that were on top of this one when it was in the other bathroom, and it doesn't fit. So, um, unless I can somehow get everything, like, super flat, I don't know how I'm going to be able to get this in there. But we're going to try, because I really, really, really don't want to have to deal with that. 
because that's just gonna make everything 10 times harder um i might keep you guys right here i feel like that'll be easier until i figure out we have more pad stuff here's my other loofah um i think i'm just gonna throw away this one because it's obviously extremely used and everywhere I'm trying to start cleaning oh i found the backup sticky stuff for my razor pure luck um so i'm gonna organize the crap out of this stuff there's a lot of stuff i really do not need like for example this mini spotting period pads um like i had those and these and i honestly hate these pads but i'm not gonna oh dude i really don't know I gotta figure out some way to organize all of this, make it a lot easier. Okay, so we fi or I finally finished the bathroom. Um, I'm gonna update you guys on what Sydney's be doing in a minute. But, so this is the sink. Ignore the popcorn, ignore this bag here. <laughs> um, this honestly will probably be folded up and to the side, but it's just like this for now. Um, so I have my toothbrush and my lotion. Toothbrush is going to be plugged up. I just got to find like another butt, a cube to put for it. Got my soap. I think this is supposed to be like a foaming container though. But as you can see, it's not foaming. I, you need foaming soap. So <laughs> I have my floss picks, my Q-tips, and my cotton pads. This is the thing we're using to open stuff. Um, I put stuff in here. We have toothpaste, more toothpaste, toothpaste already open, you know, spawn, box of band aids, and like it has it's just a first aid travel kit, it has ointment in it too. Um, two other things a deodorant, sunscreen for whenever I need it, lactate because I am lactose intolerant, um, extra floss picks, so that's all that, and then down here this is going to be extremely inconvenient but this is the only thing it fits over so i only i put it on this side because i know i'm going to be using this side less than i'm going to be using this side um but i will take it off just so i can show you guys what's in these cabinets um so and if you're wondering why i didn't put it on the side it's because it would hit this it doesn't like it won't close with it on the inside either way to be honest um so up here i have my tampons and pads on the top just so they're easy to ac access i would put them in the bathroom but i don't have any room for that um so i have oh no <laughs> this was fitting earlier this one's a little hard to get out just because of this part but um this is just the rest of like my skin scare can uh, skincare stuff in here i might move it over to the other thing to be honest i'll figure out in a second um makeup stuff as uh, you can see i've never used any of these i can't figure out what they're on <laughs> i am not a huge makeup person but i just have you know makeup for when the time comes so there's all of that which this is pretty much how this basket was before um this basket there's room for this actually there's not really but we're gonna make room um i have all my extra razor heads my moisturizer this is a clay face mask the aztec one just spray bottle for my hair um i have both of my curl creams this is my miracle curls this is miracle coily because miracle coils because walmart didn't have the one that i needed which is the curls one instead of the coil um, the other I'm using right now, I'm trying to figure out how I should move this over. Hold on. I decided it would be better if I just put this back where I had it in the first place because this is just becoming too much. It's not that difficult. Um, but that's that. Let me put this back in here. Just fixed it. Okay. Anyways, um, so this is where most of the extra stuff is like i have an extra tongue scrubber extra regular toothbrushes 
Um, this is for my tattoos, makeup brushes that I never literally ever use, face mask, extra wipes, which we'll get to in a minute, um, mouthwash, extra lotion because there's one up there, Minnesota wash, which is my toner, another perfume, extra lotion, just mostly extra stuff and then other stuff that obviously doesn't fit up there. Um, I have the hand soap to refill that one up there. This is the toilet cleaner. Just some more face masks, eyeshadow palette that I've never opened. I've had it for like two years now. Um, this is like some foot scrubber device. This is for my tooth, uh, my electric toothbrush. More Q-tips, and then this is this is like a nail shaving thing for like to do your own nails, I guess. But yeah. So that is that. And then I will show you the inside of the bathroom. Because this is just the sink area. Um, so ignore this brush. I'm honestly going to throw this away. Because I don't use it anyways. Um, but I have my trash can there. Told the bra, obviously. This cute little thing. It has like a little um, sticky thing. So I put it against the wall. And then... It can come out of the holder. You see that. But this is a silicone brush scrub. And then the little brushes for if I need it really. Flushable wipes, poopery spray, toilet. <laughs> um, the caddy, because I did not have anywhere else to put it, which is a, it's a fine spot. It's not going to get in the way. My cute shower curtain, which I said touches the ground earlier. I have... The conditioner I use for shaving there. My body wash. Um, this is my drain thing. And then like, this is like a hair catcher. And then I just put this on if I want to like fill up the tub or something. Um, and then I have my little over the head shower thing. Lufa, um, glove scrubbers, thingies. I put the new sticky stuff on the um, shaver. I have my face soaps, femme wash, and my conditioner and shampoo. The um, bathroom is done being set up. And my little bath mat, which we put the other bath mat, because obviously I already put a bath mat right there with this carpet. And we put it in um, the kitchen. So that's in there. Um, I just like you not know what's going on with this. I don't know why it's so dirty because I put all of it in the wash before I left. My mom brought it, but I'm going to figure that out later. As we've already discussed, this <laughs> is not going to be finished and probably till tomorrow, which is fine. Um, I think I'm going to have my actual hamper in here. This is just the laundry stuff for now and then extra toilet paper, paper towel. And then this is just some stuff I need to keep, like extra batteries and stuff. I'm gonna put my actual hamper in here. That way um, I could just like keep my dirty clothes, you know, out of the way, I guess. But I'm moving this out here. I honestly need to take a pee. But here's all the trash we have at the front door so far from everything we've already done. This bag it also has trash in it. I showed this area briefly earlier. This is microwave and toaster. I got my little spoon holder. Um, these are probably going to go on the counter or up here, I think. I don't know where they're going to fit. I guess just up here. Oh, no, that's not going to fit. Never mind. I lied. Whatever. We'll figure that out. But, Sydney was putting all the other stuff away. So, actually. Hold on, I don't even know where the light switch is. Where should the light? Where? Oh, I'm blind. Okay. I got it now. Okay, she put all the cups in here. So cute. Um, we got our noodle bowls. Uh, these are like for sauce condiment bowls and the regular bowls and the plates. And then I got containers and uh, baking stuff kind of over here. 
Um, that, I think I still need to wash that. And then we have my other cups, which are already clean. So I'm gonna put those up there. Okay, I gotta finish showing you guys everything that Sydney finished. But we're really getting a lot done so far. I have all of this. Um, these are all Starbucks cups, and these are all Starbucks cups, and these are all Starbucks cups. <laughs> and then just regular cups. Because I work at Starbucks. <laughs> uh, measuring cup, actually, I'm gonna move the measuring cup because, um, where should I move it to? And put it up here but yeah that stuff is still in the same place as earlier um there's nothing yeah there's nothing up here um and then yeah and then we have the pantry we have my shopping bags here for groceries that's my mom's bag and then just a random plastic bag got ziploc bags um containers for like cereal and stuff this cute snow or what am i saying <laughs> this cute christmas cookie jar um and then just random shit obviously this is not what i would be having in my pantry it's just what we have right now my brother loves his candy here and then my sexy freaking blender bro what <laughs> she's keeping the candy <laughs> and then we have this like i said for when i actually get stuff for the pantry um I'm trying to think i have more plastic bags I'm always going to put them at the bottom, to be honest, because that's what I use for the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, that's what I use for the bathroom garbage can, as well as um, when I scoop my ferrets litter, I put it in there because it just makes it easier. And I sometimes I double bag it. So yeah. it's nice to have a lot, <laughs> lots and lots and lots of shopping bags. <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. It looks so much roomier already. Did they put up the Christmas tree? We still got ornaments to put on there. The TV. You move the TV by yourself? What the heck? <laughs> um, so we have my organizers for the fridge, which aren't going to really come in handy until tomorrow, but it's fine. <laughs> Explains that there's so much trash over here. <laughs> I got to grab the pee pads. Okay, we still got stuff over here. I'm going to take this in that closet. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's for the ferrets. Those are random pillows. Do you think, um, you know, like, my my bl soft blue pillows and, like, my other random pillows? Do you think I should leave them out here on the couch or just throw them on my bed? Probably my bed, right? I think, maybe. We got this, and it, I know it's, like, high up and not, like, the normal size you would have for a coffee table. But, um, this TV is going to be on the wall. As long as everything goes well, it'll be on the wall. Um, I'm trying to figure out what to do with my record player. I think I'm going to put it back on top of the TV chest, how it was before. But I got to get that box down and the picture and then hang up the picture somewhere. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet. But yeah, the Christmas tree is cute. We got the ornaments we could put on them. Sydney's blanket and pillow. My random YouTube subscribe pillow. Sydney's phone on FaceTime. <laughs> Sydney's phone on FaceTime. <laughs> Her girlfriend is asleep. Look, oh my gosh, my plants are so cute. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna take a break. I need to go to the bathroom and eat something else because it's literally 2 a.m. And like I said before, I want all this done before I actually go to sleep. Nobody can get in your house because we got all this trash in the way. <laughs> yeah, there's Kiave has to find somebody to take my shit. There's no way. We're going to be sleeping in until like probably noon at this point. By the time we go to sleep, we're going to be sleeping in to noon. Which is not a problem at all. I haven't really been sleeping in though that much. I like kind of wake up at like 8 o'clock or something. Do you think you still will even though? Even, oh. <laughs> what the heck? Do you think you still will even though we are like still awake? Hmm? We're not tired. You're not tired? that stupid medicine the fuck he really likes to dig in their litter box was <laughs> everywhere and i saw some of it on the floor earlier so i have to um find out which bag or which box the um handheld vacuum i have is in so i can clean it up because he made a mess and i'm not happy about it <laughs> there's seriously not enough actually well, it's not as bad as i thought it was Okay, um, so I put my stuff in there. I have this, 
the um this corner um i'll probably just cut open the box of clothes so i could get into it when i need to because i have no idea where my um what's it called? pajamas went because my mom brought a lot of this stuff and i have no idea where she put it all because it was kind of just laying around or maybe i packed it up and i just forgot so i got the box open um i move it just so i'm actually a little close the door you can see my red apron um but yeah I really don't know where my, oh, I just remembered. I actually washed it, so it's in there. I'm trying to get in this box and like put the sheets on my bed. <laughs>